So originally this was gonna be a video, okay, where I just sit here playing this song that I made. A remastered version of Land of Promise, if you must know. <laughs> What's the difference? Eight instruments. But that's not what we're gonna do today, now. No, it was originally gonna be that, with some visual humor in the background, mostly to inform you guys, eh, <laughs> a sort of a good faith effort on my part to let you guys uh, in the know, as it were, that I got my hard drive, finally, and that was gonna be it. <laughs> But for some messed up reason, my mind couldn't just let it. <laughs> it couldn't. It couldn't just let it be like that. And I'm laughing because I already. <laughs> yeah, the elephant in the room is already there, man. It's. <laughs> so I thought I was being cute, right? I got all these tabs open up here. Oh, I got my hard drive. Then we got uh, myself. Sh we got myself shilling Yoko Shimomura. Nothing new there. That's uh, pretty standard. We got uh, how to check Discord. I the results were sort of inconclusive. I I just. Not really with it. <laughs> Got some stale memes, of course. This one was actually just more of a general question uh, for myself. And I was looking through it, couldn't really find any answer. What is interesting to me is the fact that despite the fact that the Avengers are hotter than ever, Odin from Fire Emblem is still like the fourth result. So uh, <laughs> I guess I must not be the only one who's had this question. Now, for those of you with weak constitutions, this may be where you want to choose to <laughs> step out of this conversation. I will completely understand. I will hold nothing against you. <laughs> So I'm gonna give a few seconds for those people to uh, exit the building now because it's all downhill from here, folks. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. I have some kind of disease, I guess. Oh, don't worry about that last tab either. I was gonna make a joke about that one, you know, try to find some stuff about Fire Emblem Revelation being good and make fun of it a little bit, but there were no results, so <laughs> it's real. How? How is that possible? And not only is it real, but it has the best title I have ever heard. Unknown from F.E. So, I haven't read this yet, obviously. Uh, if I had, I may not be making this video. I guess we're gonna see. But for those of you who do not know, the character Knuckles, okay, from the Sonic series. His theme song is called Unknown from M.E. As in the Master Emerald. It's his job. That's what he does. He guards that shit, supposedly. I don't know if he still does that. <laughs> Last time I played a Sonic game, that's what he did. Okay. This pun is so great. This is the best thing I have ever seen. And <laughs> I really don't know <laughs> what kind of messed up crap we're about to see. But I couldn't make this video and not click this link. <laughs> Let's just see what happens. This is a bad idea. How did I? How did it come to this? <laughs> oh, oh, yep. Oh, wow. Fiction rated M. What? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. Let's stop right now. <laughs> Do we even proceed? Okay. Okay. What, what's the synopsis? Tell me more about your story. Sell me on this, Mr. Force Abeya. Who the hell is this? Force. Knuckles loses all hope in life until he meets the love of his lo life. So like, subscribe and give me money. <laughs> is this gonna be one of those stories? I think it just might be, folks. I. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> It was a bright and sunny day. Knuckles woke up with anger in his eyes, and only he knew why. Sonic came up to him and said, Hey, Knuck, something bugging ya? With a smirk on his- That's my- That's my Sonic impression, by the way. <laughs> Knuckles angrily replied, I don't. Oh, I don't- I'm sorry. I don't think I'll ever find love, Sonic. I think the girls just don't like it when I fist metal crack- No, fuck it. Do I really want to know? <laughs> I can't do this. Okay, so... That's a line from one of the levels, right? Like, from one of the... Because when you play Sonic 2, Sonic Adventure 2 specifically, right, each, each level has, like, some rap lyrics to it, and I'm pretty sure that... <laughs> Fist Metal Crack'em is a, is a line from one of those songs. There's... Okay, so this is... At, at the very least, there's no way this is serious, right? No, now it's gonna bug me. Pumpkin Hill, right? Pumpkin Hill? That was the... You know me, the fighting freak, Knuckles! And we're at Pumpkin Hill! 
I don't care, man. I played this game too much. <laughs> Where is it? Yup, yup. Yo. Yo. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we know that the great emerald's power allows Knuckles to feel. But does it allow him to love? Let's continue, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Knuckles runs outside. The thorn dike. The thorn dike. Who's who the fuck? Man, I guess my Sonic lore is now what it used to be. Who who's Thorndike? What? Runs outside a Thorndike household and finds something very strange. A portal. Huh. <sighs> Must be one of Eggman's tricks. Knuckles said to himself. He runs towards it and sees a masked blue figure coming out, running with a sword. <laughs> Sonic runs outside to see what's happening. <laughs> Eventually, Tails and everyone else does as well. They all huddle around. The mysterious masked memer in a bed. <laughs> Fuck off! Keep this up and I'm kicking your ass. <laughs> really? <laughs> how do you, like, how does... I mean, yeah, I'm the one that searched for it, okay? <laughs> But how did you create this? We can't just absolve the author of all of their responsibility just because this is a joke, okay? They thought of this crap. These words ran through their head in this order, they put it to paper, and they submitted it online for people to see. <laughs> okay, let's see. Where was I? This is only 442 words long, guys, and I can't... Okay. Okay, we're with the masked mirror, and eventually they get them to talk. They take off their masks, revealing a beautiful face with azure blue eyes and soft... Wow. Oh, ooh, ooh. All right, Dave Duke. Jeez, roll it back, why don't you, huh? Ooh. She rises from the ground and says, My name is Lucina. Fuck me. Uh, yeah, I can't do it, Lord Bailey. That's not happening, so I'm just gonna read. My name is Lucina, and I have come from the world of Awakening to warn you all about something. World of a what? What? Oh no, that, that's Sonic. I'm sorry. World of a what? What? Said Sonic. Lucina then turns to Knuckles and stares at him. Her azure eyes and his violet eyes locked, and then they both knew they were perfect for each other. I'm gonna start popping some kneecaps. <laughs> Lucina shakes herself out of her current frozen state, and so does Knuckles. They all go into the Thorndike house and talk about the situation. Creatures called Titans are after the Chaos Emeralds, and I was sent by Prince Azura of Station Square to help you all. But isn't Station Square down the street? Yeah, hey, that's a good question, Dales. Isn't Station Square part of the Sonic universe? This continuity is all kinds of messed up. I don't know if I can really trust this author to weave a proper tale at this point. Uh, said Dales before being interrupted by- Oh, not before being interrupted, excuse me. Before interrupted by Knuckles. Shut up, Tails! Let the lady speak! Come on, pussy! Tails knew what was going on, so he decided to hop on his tornado with Sonic and fly to a new world. Which resulted in the beginning of Lost World, obviously. So I see how they- I like how they tied that back into the Sonic canon universe. <laughs> Making this about- <laughs> So this is exactly what they were doing before the start of that game, in case you didn't know. I'm surprised they didn't include that in a cutscene, but I do think that that was included in the manual if you read into it, so... This all checks out. True story. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Knuckles and Lucina are all alone now. Knuckles reaches for Lucina's hand and says, Lucina, I want you to know that my love for you is as big as the Master Emerald. Oh, Knuckles, you have such a way with the words. They're the cheesiest <laughs> line you have. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got a glimpse of the next line. Oh, this is... Oh, no. <laughs> Lucina leans in for a kiss, and so does Knuckles. And then suddenly Rouge busts in the door and throws dummy rings at Lucina. Lucina unsheathes her sword and says, Come at me, Rouge! Rouge then gets stabbed and dies at all. Oh, 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 this got dark. Oh, this got dark. Knuckles shows Lucina his what now? Nice. Is, is that is that a new name? Oh, his foreheader, and she says, "Oh, Naga, I was not, not fucking likely." Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. I th I think we're done. 
<laughs> You're joking. <laughs> Pass were not strong enough. I I just added the number one, and now it's strong enough. Excellent. Who writes like this? Oh, of course it was wrong. Still a better love story than what Twilight would read again. Mm, eight out of ten. Okay, so in conclusion, I think that we can all agree that the internet was a mistake as well as anything related to Fire Emblem. I guess that's going to do it for me today. See you guys uh, tomorrow, probably. See you then. Peace. Great. Now I'm a walking sex joke. That was a great idea.